Hello, this is Gary Tasman with Cushman & Wakefield Commercial Property, Southwest Florida. Today, I'm going to go over some new information, new data that we just got um, on our retail market. And I think it's going to be interesting to see what's happened in the retail market because of COVID, obviously. But in addition to that, to look at some of the accelerations that have taken place due to COVID, but were already in place. Most things we talk about a lot are the bricks to clicks business model that, that's been transforming retail in the United States and the world for you know almost a decade now. It's very interesting to know that our vacancy rates from pre-COVID to post-COVID, which are actually now in this sitting about a year, um, they haven't really changed that much. We have a slight increase you know, less than a half a percentage increase in, in vacancy rates. And our rents are actually in most submarkets going up. Um, so the, the retail market in Southwest Florida is healthy, which is counterintuitive to the first part of this conversation of uh, talking about uh, bricks to clicks. But the truth is, because of our population boom, retail is doing just fine. And there are certain components of retail that either can't be effectively delivered via the internet or the consumer preference is that they don't want it via the internet. So there's always going to be a need for retail and it's certainly in, in Southwest Florida where, we, where we're going to continue to change how we consume retail goods and services, but we're still going to consume them. And, and, and in, in most cases, you're going to see that consumption is going to grow when the population grows. We've talked a lot about the housing boom in Southwest Florida, the population boom, the great quality of life we have here. It's all scaling over to a stable retail market now. So you would expect in Southwest Florida, the two greatest population growth areas are Cape Coral and South Lee County. North Collier County. That's where the retail expansion is occurring. The product types that we're seeing in expansion are by and large smaller freestanding retail. So you're not seeing um, a new Walmart. I haven't seen a new Costco in years. I don't think you're going to see a BJ's. You're going to see groceries pop up peri you know, sporadically following the retail uh, growth. And then you're going to see the necessity retail and entertainment retail continue to grow again as our population grows. So I'm excited to tell the audience today that retail is alive and well in Southwest Florida. And again, it's contrary and counterintuitive in most cases to the headlines that you read around the, the United States and in other parts of the country. But we're blessed in Southwest Florida to have a very, very strong retail market. And I expect that it's going to continue as our population continues to grow.